Yep, this is my MSI GS73 Stealth Pro. Um, I opened it up to my brother's laptop, and I'm gonna clean out the fans. I can see there's dust here. I can see there's a little dust over here, and the heat sinks is on the other side, so I gotta remove the board. Um, I'm gonna put in that nice thermal paste I bought. Let's see if I can get my temps down because my CPU is definitely overheating. And my brother did say that this laptop needed to, that this needed to be done to it. It's a pretty nice machine. Battery over here, hard drive, and the RAM and every SSD is all around the other side of this board. I'm gonna take a look at the power chips and everything just to see if I get to get like a blueprint for this machine. So, wish me luck. I'll be absolute careful with this because this is a $500 motherboard right here. So. Can't mess this up. Wish me luck. Finally got out down to the motherboard. It didn't even take that long either. It's kind of easy. Easier than I thought. Um, look at this. Look at how dry the heat sink compound is on this. So you can tell it's dry because I'm going like this. Now look. Ain't nothing getting on my fingers. Just a little bit. So if it's dry like this, that means that it's losing its thermal conductivity. So what we're going to do is, we're going to put some MX4 on here. See how my temperatures are. This is my, my um, GPU right here, the NVIDIA 10670, no it's a 1060. And you see all the RAMs right there. That's the South Bridge right here. All the, um, the LPC bus, embedded controller. RAM, SSD, hard drive, and CPU. Okay, here we go. Power, lights, action. Fan was dirty and everything. My baby is back. Oh, look at how fast she is, too. Well, I'm going to run a temperature track now. Looks like my temps are a lot better. Stress test has been running for 10 minutes. And my CPU temps are at 76, 77. Before that thing used to go up to like 95. GPU temps are pretty much stable also. So I think this helped. I'm running the stress test and hearing music at the same time.